Hi, my name's Grace. I'm a part of the sales team and I'll be giving you a demo of Fleetio today. From the dashboard here, I can quickly click into my active vehicles and see which ones are available for jobs. I can easily filter and sort. So if I want to see all of my vehicles in my list, I can clear those filters there and get a clear picture of all of my vehicles. You can also customize this view so I can easily manage my columns and then pull what fields or what data points are the most important to me onto the list. This is gonna be a quick jumping off point. So if I want to drill down into a particular vehicle or asset, I can do that here and it's gonna take me to the vehicle overview. The vehicle overview in Fleetio is really the electronic filing cabinet for your assets. A vehicle in Fleetio can really be not just an over the road vehicle, but a vehicle, trailer, bulldozer, forklift, anything that is heavy equipment or vehicle that you're tracking maintenance on and that you're tracking your cost on. So on this vehicle overview here, you'll see it's really going to capture everything past, present, and future that's going on with this vehicle. So if I want to click into the service history records, we'll see those here. I can see my fuel history. And then we can see any open issues, any previously submitted inspections, work orders, really anything that's ever happened. You can also keep your photos and documents on the vehicle here. So a lot of people will keep copies of registration, insurance information, all that can be housed on the vehicle overview so that when you're on the road and you need a document quickly, you can pull it up on the app Fleetioco. On the right hand side, we can see what's outstanding on this vehicle. So we can see I have an issue that was reported. Don't have any service reminders that are coming up just yet, but we do have some renewal reminders. This would be anything that is from an admin perspective that you need to keep track of. So not maintenance, but anything that is triggered based on time, like emissions tests, registration renewals, insurance renewals, annual inspections, anything that, that's on a, a schedule that you need to keep up with, you can get rid of those spreadsheets that you're using today and use our proactive reminders for that. The most powerful part of this vehicle overview here will be where we're calculating the total cost of ownership. So whether it's your service cost from outsource maintenance or in-house maintenance or your fuel costs, which come in from fuel entries or integrations with fuel cards or any other cost, including expenses uh, like toll passes, parking passes, car washes, insurance, registration, anything that is a cost of this vehicle, it will be totaled up in this number here. And then we'll pull that into the total cost of ownership. This is really critical when making decisions around which assets to replace. You can always benchmark the total cost of ownership of each vehicle against each other and then therefore know which one is costing you the most money. The other thing I wanna point out here is the different tabs on the vehicle overview. So we can keep track of the life cycle details, how much we expect or how long we expect this vehicle to run. The specs and engine and transmission information, this will come in automatically into Fleetio from the VIN for any vehicles that were manufactured in North America. Wheels and tire sizes, fluid capacity, and then you can also keep track of your purchase information and your loan and lease information here.